Let me introduce two plugins that can show charts on a website. The first plugin has beautiful modern design and we can edit with Elementor Page Builder. The second plugin looks like old fashioned but it supports .csv file import with free. Let's get started. Go to the plugin menu and press add new button. Search by chart. Install and activate the Graphena. Move to the page menu. Press edit with Elementor link under home page. Scroll down, to find the Graphena. Then, drag and drop the chart elements to the right. It has awesome animation effects when the chart is displayed. It's great to use as a section on the front page. Let's check it on the front end. Let me add a few more charts. Bar chart. Pie chart. Radar chart. Animated radar chart. Timeline chart. As you know well how to edit the title, select the title and edit it on the left. Select element 1, we can edit the chart data here. We can add additional column by pressing a duplicate icon. Change the numbers, after duplication. In the element setting, we can modify design elements, things like color, transparency and so on. We can modify the X and Y axes as well. In the chart data option, we can change the data source from manual to dynamic. There is a function CSV import, but it need to purchase the pro version. In chart settings options, there are general options like animation. In the category area we can rename or add x-axis. There is a undefined title because I duplicated a data just before, you can change the name by adding an item. Let me change the radar chart. Radar chart is often used when showing a taste profile on the coffee website. Anyone who make coffee websites, I think, this is a beautiful option. Go to the chart settings category. Let's change the months to the aromas. Go to element 1, change the values. In the case of coffee website, Every coffee bean page needs aroma indicator. If you add this chart, your website looks very professional. Let's install the second chart plugin. You don't need to worry using multiple chart plugin at the same time, because there is few confliction among chart plugins. Install and activate the visualizer. Go to the visualizer plugin menu and click the add new button. Select a chart style. Click the next button. As you can see, click the pi.csv file link. This is a sample file. Open and save changes with your own data. Click the Choose File button and select your CSV file. Press Import button. Then, the new chart data loaded. 
press the Create Chart button. Click the scissors icon at the bottom left of the chart, then, the shortcode is copied to the clipboard. Go to the page that you want to add the chart. Paste the shortcode. Check it on the front end web page.